we cut the ceremony, the Honorable, jo the Honorable Charles Wesley Bond will come and lead a word of prayer. Let us look to the Lord. Dear God, we just come before your throne of grace this evening, God. First of all, to say thank you, God. Thank you for your traveling mercies, God. We thank you, God, for what you have done this day, God. We thank you for September the 9th, 2014, for birthing um, this Assembly of Christ, God. And we ask you, um, just continue to bless Pastor, bless First Lady Bishop Alway, and First Lady um, God, as we go into this next level, Father God. We just thank you for everyone that is here this evening. We ask a special blessing and let the body say in Jesus' name. In Jesus', Jesus name. name. We decree and count it done. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. 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 One half, half on this side, half on yes. this side. Can we have some of you come on this side? <clears throat> I'm going to ask First Lady to take the scissors. If you give someone your food. Thank you. Open to you now. I can give the keys to someone. We dedicate, Lord, we dedicate the sanctuary for your use. We thank you, Lord, for the owners and for raising up people, God, who could be a blessing to help our ministry grow. We thank you, Lord, for the vision that wherever you are, that, that's where there's liberty. We thank you, God, in the presence of joy that we stand here today. We thank you, Lord, in your presence. And God, we know, God, that there are many people who have come to this space. And Lord, but while we're here, we ask, Lord, that you just bless it. May there be people get saved in the name of Jesus. Yes. God, as we cut this ribbon, Lord, God, may you cut asunder the chains and curses that are upon many of your people as they're crying out for someone to preach and teach the unadulterated word of God. And Lord, we ask God, Lord, that you would bless First Lady and I. Cover us with your blood, body, soul, and spirit. God, remember the backsliders, Lord. Remember those who need to be healed and delivered and set free. And God, Lord, we know that this is not, this is not the end. This is just the beginning. And Lord, we know that, God, this church will experience supernatural, phenomenal growth and multiplication in the name of Jesus. And God, it will be a quality ministry in the name of Jesus. And God, it will be a place where people can feel the peace, the power, and the presence of God in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, bless all of the elders, the ministers, the deacons, the missionaries, every sound tech, every worker, the young people, the children. Bless, oh, God, hallelujah, each and every person that walks through this door. And may they feel the presence of you, Lord Jesus. And God, we want all we want to do is make you famous. We give you glory in advance. And we thank you, God, that you, oh God, have opened up a door. You have favored us, God. Yes. yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You favored us, God. Though we have little, you have blessed us with much. And Lord, we come into this place to give you praise. We come in to give you thanksgiving. And God, we honor you. And God, be always lifted up. Be always lifted up in every faith assembly of Christ that's planted around the world. Oh God, may people see you and not man. May people see you and not the flesh. May they hear a fresh word every Sunday, every weeknight. God, may the spirit of faithfulness, oh God, transfer to the new ones that are going to come in. And may they look and see the veterans and the gladiators who have endured hard trials. And God, may they, oh God, may this be a place where our ministry gifts will be fully operationalized. God, will you multiply our, our joy and our happiness. And God, as we cut this ribbon, Lord, we thank you, Lord, that one day that we'll enter into heaven and you'll say, well done, thou good and faithful servant. Enter thou into the joy of the Lord. That God, this ribbon, this red ribbon represents your blood. And God, as, as Elder T and I cut it, it represents, God, you being pleased, oh God, with everything that we do and say. Oh, God, you raise up um, evangelism teams that will go to Forestville and Fort Washington and Akakee. You raise up evangelism teams, God, that will go to Bowie and Largo and Kettering. In the name of Jesus, you raise up, um, uh, you raise up witnessing teams that will go to Greenbelt, Father. In the and, 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 God, and, and in Forestville and Upper Marlboro and in Suitland, God, I know you're already speaking to your people. And God, we call forth all those souls in all these areas of the Beltway in the name of Jesus. Yes, and God, we call them forth that there's a place where they can come yes. and worship and praise you. And God, now we ask your blessing upon us in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 First lady, you have the honor.
And it is, it is your season of yes. Even when you're out of season, God can still give you a yes. So whatever you're looking for tonight, know this, that God wants to say yes, but it has to be in his season. And sometimes we have to wait, but the Bible promises this, that if we would wait, we would be like a tree planted by the rivers of water, and whatever we do, it would prosper. And it is season. So God has a season to everything. There is a season, and this is a season for this baby to be brought forth. And we say yes. And God says yes. And you have to cooperate and agree with God. So when God is asking you to do something, I always say that for every new level, there is a yes. Yeah, hallelujah. You come in, you get saved. That's your first yes. yes it is. Then when God wants to, to, to indwell you with his Holy Spirit, then you're saying yes. Then God said, can I use you? Then you say yes. yes. And then some of us say, wait up. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. <laughs> then some of us say, wait a minute. But God is always calling on us, and he's calling for a yes. How many of you all are ready to give God a yes? yes. God, I'm ready to give you a yes tonight. Father, we thank you for being inside of this building. We thank you, oh God, for your glory that reigns because we brought you here with us. That's why we know for sure that you are here. Thank you for everyone arriving safely. Thank you, oh God, for bringing us to this destination. Now, Father, as we come, we ask that you would bless everything that will be said and done. Someone needs a word for their life tonight, and we know that your word can change a life just yes. like that. Yes. As it is being released, Father, may our hearts be prepared. May it fall on good soil even this night. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Come on, give yes. God a hand and clap of prayer. I need some people who know about yes. Give somebody a hug near you and say, I love you, and there's nothing you can do about it. Love you, love you, love you, love you, love you, love Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord. Amen. We're going to do our worship decree in just a moment. And glory to God, we want to welcome all of our guests. We want to thank you for coming. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We're going to move uh, in a very, very, very purposeful way tonight. And tonight, we're going to begin with prayer. And I'm going to ask if uh, Judah Sheila would lead us in a word of prayer. Give Judah a big hand as he comes. Amen. Would you stand and hold somebody's hand? Judah, just pray. Let the Holy Spirit pray. You're just an awesome prayer warrior. We thank God for you. And ask God's blessing upon this place. Dear Lord, we thank you for this place to worship in. We thank you for this new assembly that we can spread your word and that more people can be saved. Yes. And Amen. more people. Amen. Uh, Amen. Oh, well. Oh, there it is. Um, and we can just learn and live and that more people in this area can come and worship here and that it'll be more convenient for them. Yeah. And we thank you, Lord, for just blessing us with this place. Yeah. And that we thank just you thank you, Lord, for all yeah. that you've given us. Yeah. And just, I don't really know how to say it, but yeah, you're... Yeah. Hmm. Well, Lord, we just thank you for all your blessings that you've given us and that we can now spread our word and that you can just, and that this new vessel will just flow through us and that we can use this as a place of worship. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Come on, give it up for the Lord in Judah. Amen, 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 amen. I'm going to ask you to remain standing just for a moment, and we're going to ask the Lord to bless us as we give God our worship decree, and then followed by the, um, the scripture, and I'm going to ask Elder Charles to read Psalm 150. Amen. Amen. So I'm going to ask Celebration to come on up, and they're going to lead us as they do in Washington, D.C. Come on, Minister Donna, all the Celebration. 
Come on up. Amen. 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 And then after we do our worship decree, Elder Charles will read Psalm 150, and then we're going to sing a song of praise unto the Lord. Amen. 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 We'll do our worship decree first. Amen. Come on up. All the celebration. You know it. Join in with us, Elk T. Amen. Let's give the Lord our decree of worship in Jesus' name. We, we are the next generation serving the exceptional God. Faith and Center of Christ Incorporated is an excellent driven church. Believing God can do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that we can ask or think, according to the Holy Ghost power that is in us to all generations. Every day we go to this mountain to worship and experience the abundant life in Jesus Christ. As we do, we experience and enjoy the power, the peace, and the presence of God through our sacrifices of praise. In the face of logic and need, we are going up yonder to worship God in the spirit of faith and thanksgiving. We believe Jesus loves, Jesus saves, Jesus heals, Jesus provides, and that Jesus is coming in name. For the true worshipers who worship Him in spirit and in truth, we are born in this mountain to worship. <laughs> Praise the Lord, saints. I will read it to you here in Psalms 150, and I'll wait for you if you like to. Um, when you have a say, amen. 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 Okay. <laughs> Praise you, the Lord. Praise God in his sanctuary. Praise him in the firmament of his power. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him according to his excellent greatness. Praise him with the sound of the trumpet. Praise him with the psaltery and the harp. Praise him with the tremble and dance. Praise him with the string instruments and organs. Praise him um, upon the loud cymbals. Praise him upon the high-sounding cymbals. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Can lie. 